This is Moms Every Day, making life easier for moms everywhere, every day. Welcome to MomsEveryDay.com. Joining us is Dr. Amanda Worrell with the West Villa Maria Vet Clinic. And Dr. Worrell, we love getting those new puppies and new kittens. They are so sweet and we want to make sure they stay healthy. So we need to keep them up to date on their shots. Yes, absolutely. As the owner of a new puppy or kitten, they really need three sets of their puppy or kitten shots. Mm -hmm. uh, puppies, we are vaccinating for a number of viruses, most notably the parvovirus and the distemper virus. They are very contagious among puppies and they are fatal if not treated. Oh, wow. um, for kittens, we are, uh, we're mainly vaccinating for a number of uh, respiratory viruses right. that are very contagious among kittens. Um, and as puppies or kittens, they need three shots. Mm -hmm. uh, we like to do those no earlier than six weeks, the first shot, and then two to three weeks thereafter. So come in no earlier than six weeks for your first shot, and then two to three weeks we'll do the second shot, two to three weeks after that we'll do the third shot. Uh, when it comes to rabies, kittens and puppies, they both need to be at least 12 weeks old. So when they reach 12 weeks old, bring them in. That's usually with the third, the second or third set of, of puppy or kitten shots. Um, so when they're 12 weeks old, bring them in. We'll get them vaccinated for the rabies virus. That's also when they can get the rabies tag. That's also when they can get the county tag. Lots of great information. Of course, always that threat year round. So there's not a season where we can yeah. say. Yeah. yeah, unfortunately in Texas, the, the temperature is just so moderate that all those viruses seem to persist year round. Absolutely. Well, thanks so much for that very helpful mm -hmm. information. Of course, mm -hmm. if you'd like to learn more about new puppy and kitten shots, just log on to momseveryday.com slash BCS.